If we wanted to fill every corner of the world with people, leaving no space, how many people do you think we would need? Have you ever questioned how much space we take up as humanity? After all, there are 8 billion of us on Earth, and our numbers are increasing every day. In fact, if we ask this, how many people would be needed in a scenario where we filled the Earth completely with humans? We can't just limit the answer to this question to a thought experiment. We can say that it's a great way to understand the size of our planet, the scale of humanity. First, how big is the Earth? The total surface area of the Earth is 510 million square kilometers, but 71% of it is covered by water. So the land mass we can actually stand on is 148.7 million square kilometers. This includes the entire land area, including deserts, forests, and mountains. Some places are of course uninhabitable, but we will use all of them in this calculation. How much space does a person take up? The average person, standing up, takes up about 0.1 square meters of space. That's similar to the amount of space people would take up at a crowded concert venue when they were standing close together. So we could squeeze 10 people into one square meter. Now let's convert this to square kilometers, number of people that can fit into one square kilometer area. When we multiply the total land area by the number of people per square kilometer, we reach the result. The total number of people needed is 1.487 quadrillion people. Number of people currently living on Earth, around 8 billion. So to realize this scenario, we would need about 186,000 times as many people as today's human population. Another question, how many times can all the people in the world, if lined up side by side, encircle the world? The average person's shoulder width can be considered approximately 50 centimeters. The circumference of the Earth is approximately 40,075 kilometers along the equator. The world population is currently approximately 8 billion people. If 8 billion people are lined up side by side, the total length is 4 million kilometers. If the circumference of the Earth is 40,075 kilometers, how many times can this length wrap around the Earth? When we do the calculation, the result is 99.8. That means if all the people in the world were lined up side by side, they could circle the world almost 100 times. It's hard to even visualize it. I hope your predictions were correct. Finally, if all the people who lived and disappeared suddenly appeared on Earth, how many billions would our total population be? It is not possible to give a definitive answer to this question since more than 99% of modern human history has not been recorded, but it is possible to make a rough estimate thanks to some calculations. So where do we start counting? The number of people who lived before modern humans is almost zero compared to the total number of people, because they did not have a population that grew as fast as ours, so they do not have a significant effect on the calculation. 50,000 BC is a good starting year for a reliable estimate, because it is possible to estimate the number of people at that time. According to calculations based on various assumptions, the answer to this question is approximately 117 billion. Although we are a slow reproducing species compared to other species, the damage we do is so great that the problems brought about by high population growth will probably cause our extinction. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.